let me explain a little and then we'll see what's left not, okay. not clear. Okay. Uh, one of the difficulties is that steps imply that you go in order and when you finish three you right. do four and so on. But with 10, 11 and 12, uh, you go back and forth across many right. times. Right. Because the playing is fun. Right. The setting it down when you finally have it, well, okay. But the playing is the fun part. I want to say, in addition to the ordinary use of the word is, yeah, that there I are, have that. <laughs> I thought down. you would. Is. <laughs> there are two other. There are two other ways of using the word is, is more precisely, and they're very different. Okay. So. In step 11, the, the word is, I put it in capital letters, and uh, there you are crossing two things. Mm -hmm. And that, for example, that comes in in many ways. It's a kind of thinking to do that, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. that big is. So if, say, like we were talking earlier, the felt sense is biological, mm -hmm. then I would say, well, wait, biology is in some way, mm -hmm. among other things, a felt sense. Mm -hmm. And there you're equating two things that are not at all the same. Right, right. You're crossing them. Right. But this is the, the excited, fun, interesting part is if you do that, then you go in. So instead of saying, well, let's see, what do I know about a felt sense already? And what do I know about uh, biology? And then trying to say something that would please both biologists and mm -hmm. focusing people mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and making up something here, you would go into your sense of how biology could possibly be okay. All right. a felt sense. And in that way, you also have with you everything you know about biology, and you also have with you everything you know about a felt sense, but you have it in your organism. Mm -hmm. You have it in your body. You have it organically. And for a little while, you're, 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 the first thing to do is to fix it a little. I wanted to say biology is, among other things, a felt right, sense. Right, right. So it's quite clear that a, a biological process can think. Yeah. So then yeah. if the concepts in biology are such that that doesn't make any sense, then that isn't how we mean biology. Mm -hmm. But there is a understanding of biology that isn't there in those concepts. That's right. That's right. Right? And so when we, when we uh, sleep and eat or something, everybody will say, that's biological. But when I'm sitting here talking and gesturing and philosophizing, but that's also biological. Right. And so whatever biological means, it has to be possible. Right. To, right? Right. So in right. the process model, if you, you know, step, stages five, six, seven, and eight, but every step is step five in that sense. Yes. It's a yeah. re-modified, re right. so, right. so thinking and talking is a special case of biological tissue process, right? right? right. And it, it used to be that they would think it was only the brain who does any kind of yeah. thinking. But it's quite clear now that that's not yeah, true. That's not, yeah. And how you live your life affects your feet and affects every organ in your body. And so now I've begun to, s to fill in mm -hmm. how biology can be a felt sense and a felt sense can be biological. Mm -hmm. Now from all that stuff that I said, I could then take some terms that could go in between if I were making a theory. And this, this would be the X and the Y? Yes. Yeah, okay. I got that. Yes. So the is, uh, the I, S, so this is, is the big like is. a big uh, placeholder for getting into the inherent relation in yes. there. It helps you to keep it open, to keep the space. Well, Wait uh, with placeholder because that's important too. But I would say you're crossing them when you say yeah. is in this big way, and the crossing has to happen in your body because but the is you is are holding it, uh, giving you permission, or or how would I put it? The, the is is standing there so that you can do that. Is that right? 
So that yes, even more strongly, it's doing that. Right. I am being biology. That's right. Right? Yeah, yeah. So I'm not just asserting that somewhere else in the world out there is a biology and out there is a felt sense and I'm going to tell you about it. I'm yeah, being you are, it. Yeah, you are in it. Yeah. I'm being it. Yeah. And so I can look then to see what have I got here when I'm saying it. Right. Because I say it, oh, that's what you meant by placeholder. Right. I'm saying it before I know what it can mean. Right. Yes, yeah. yes, yes. Because right. you're saying that these two things, one is the other, when you know perfectly well they're not. That's right. But then you can go see how, what could that mean. And this organic crossing is in a way more reliable, much more reliable, then putting the concepts together up here and saying, right. okay, now how do these two things relate? If you live them, they're already related and you get to go in there and see how are they related. Mm. So then out of all the things I said, if I had to pick certain things to try out in, in 12, if this was my step mm -hmm. 11, mm -hmm. then I would say the, that I would want to keep the sense in which the word biology means the, the biological process of using the word. The yeah, other okay. equal sign okay. is in step 12 where the concepts are already defined in terms of each other. Right. Okay, so so that, that would be this playing between step 10 and 11. And 12. And because 12. you see it doesn't work so you go back around. Right. So, so by the time you come to 12 then your terms are fixed. Well, let's say by the time you take seriously what you have in 12, your terms are fixed. Okay. But I want to make sure that people that know people that you can start trying to do this and then it doesn't work and then you go see why it doesn't work right. and then you're back in 10 and 11. Okay. Okay. you can do TAE all day long, you know, you do TAE with, with your boss or some very touchy person or whatever, and you wouldn't say, well, now I'll teach you TAE, step one, two, three, you don't have to do that, you just say, when you said da-da-da-da-da-da, what did you want that to mean, or what were you hoping that I would understand from those words, or, you know, if you, those words really worked, what would a person get out of them, or can you say more what you mean by nature? 